Hey guys, welcome to my first voiceover. So let's get started with the Stardust palette. Super excited. I'm filming the look I'm going to show you right now. So we're going to go ahead and get started with the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. I'm taking that all over the lid as well as under the brow bone and under the lower lash line. Next, I'm taking Selfie and I'm making that my brow bone highlight. And I'm following the directions that tell me how to do this look on the cards that came with this kit. So yeah. Next, I'm taking Double Tap with a dual-ended fluffy brush I got in my Wet n Wild um, Fergie palette. I love this brush so much. It's so, so easy to work with and blend eyeshadows out with. So I'm taking Double Tap and just blending that all over the lid as well as the crease. Next, I'm going to take Sin City and I'm putting that in the outside corner of my eye and the inside corner of my eye. So right near the tear duct and on the outside V area of my eye. And I'm just blending that out with a really, really small, um, very precise brush. So this is the e.l.f. Precision brush, I think it's called. It's part of their essential line. And you can see right here, I'm putting that right into the inner corner of my eye as well. Um, if there's one thing I can say about this brush, it's actually, it kind of hurts to work with just because it's so like prickly. They're not the softest brushes, the essential line brushes, but they get the job done nonetheless. So, yeah. Next, I'm just going to show you the progress we've been making so far. And then I'm going to take the Sin City shade again with the same precise brush. And I'm just going to take that all along the lower lash line. You can see Nick on the right hand side corner there. I'm just like, can you please go away? Thanks. So I'm going to go back again with the same brush and the same shade and just go ahead and smudge that out in the lower lash line and make it very smoky, which we all know how much I love smoky. Next, I'm going to be going into Golden Nugget using my Naked 2 brush, but you will see that I'm actually going to be spraying my brush in a couple seconds because using this shadow dry is awful. Like, you get no pigmentation, which really sucks. So, I went ahead and sprayed my brush using my Victoria's Secret setting spray, and I got a little bit better pigmentation, but then I decided to go ahead and use my finger and got the best pigmentation out of all of the different options I did. So, use your finger if possible, your clean fingers. Next, I'm going to go in with my blending brush and just clean everything up just so everything looks blended and perfect like it should. Next, I'm going to be taking Selfie again on that same precision brush I used earlier and using that shade as my inner corner highlight. I love this highlight. And then I'm going to put some mascara on using the Better Than Sex mascara. Love it so far. No complaints as of right now. And then you're going to see me try to put some foundation on because y'all know, I told you guys, I was out of foundation and it took me forever a day plus one to get this foundation out. So I use little dots and I blend everything out and make it work. So I made it work and that's that. But that's all for the voiceover portion. So now we're going to go into me actually talking. So thank you so much for watching, guys. Leave me a comment. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye. So this is the finished look. Overall, I'm impressed with the quality of the shadows. They're very, very, very pigmented. Very, very nice. Very easy to work with as well. If there's one tip I can give to you if you're using this palette, especially with the more glittery shades, like I had to use Golden Nugget. I had to use Golden Nugget on the center of my lid, and I tried using my Naked 2, the Duo Ended brush. I tried to do it dry with no Fix Plus or anything on my brush, but I ended up having to really soak my brush and then dip into Golden Nugget. Even when I did that, it was still not as pigmented as I really wanted it to be. So I had to go with my finger and I pressed it and that's when it gave me this. So, um, yeah. Uh, overall, like I said, I'm very impressed with it. I'm very happy with the quality of the eyeshadows. I'm gonna try to do each of these looks, make it like a tutorial throughout the day and see how easy it is to follow along with these. So I did Stardust, so next week I think I'm gonna do Comment Queens since I like that one so much. And then we'll just follow out from there for the rest of them. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I just tried doing my first voiceover, if you guys obviously just heard a couple minutes ago. Let me know how you think. If, if you think it looks sounds good, do I need some improvement? Um, it's new equipment, so I'm still getting used to it. But I'm very, very happy that I actually have this kind of thing that I can do it now. So yay for improvement on technology. I will see you guys in the next video. Love you. Bye.